Hi guys. Welcome to our YouTube channel. Welcome, welcome, welcome. welcome. If you don't know us, I'm Leon Ting. I'm Linia. And welcome to the Triple L. So please do not forget to subscribe. 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 Okay, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait for you to subscribe. Yes. Are you done yet? Okay, you are done. Well, thank you guys for subscribing. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for subscribing. So today's topic is truth hurts. Yes, the truth hurts. You know? Have you ever told somebody told you about the truth? Well, yeah, many times. About you, the yeah. truth about you. Somebody told. You. Yeah, I've, someone has told me the truth about me many, many times. Like I'm, what? Like, many people used to say, oh my goodness, you're so skinny. Which is true, I am skinny, but I mean, it's not like it's something I can change. That's just how I look like. I mean, if it was like behavior, maybe someone says, oh my goodness, this just I just don't like the fact that you're so discouraging. Every single time we try to do something you're just negative about it but i'm not like that the people simply just told me that oh my goodness you're so skinny and you know i mean i can't lie to myself and be like no i'm not skinny but i am oh i'm sad i'm not i'm not i am skinny you see but it was just something it's a truth that i shouldn't be ashamed of it's something i should be happy about but then there are those truths that you should be upset about because they are just not good for your reputation and they are just not good for you hmm? Like, for instance, I mean, don't, we all hate the truth. Who doesn't like, who loves the truth? Like me, I was taught many, many times that maybe the truth about people that are around me. Mm -hmm. Somebody can say that they don't want you, they don't like you mm -hmm. uh, because of this and this. And because maybe the behavior, mm -hmm. like as I told you the other time, uh, there, there was a woman who was um, babysitting a child. Yeah. And then this woman, I I saw her at the market, and then I come to her, I greet her, and then I say, "Oh, you are babysitting whose child?" And then she tell me, "Oh, me, I don't like children," is what I said. And then maybe one day I was with this woman as well, and then I said, "I don't like children," but I cannot remember yeah. if I said like that. But her, she just you know have it. She remembered because it's yeah. not the first time she said it. She says it constantly. She doesn't like kids, right? Yes. And then uh, just her reaction, how to take action on me. Mm -hmm. Then he said, Lenia, this is not my first time to hear from you that mm -hmm. you don't like children. Mm -hmm. You were once a child as well. Mm -hmm. Where do you think you are coming from? Do you think your mother just bring you on earth on no. that age? Mm -hmm. huh? You were once a child. You, you, <laughs> you was a child. And then when she said like that, really it touched my heart. And then I remember the way I grew up as well. I grew up really uh, in the way, the bad way that uh, I don't want. I will say this uh, one day. Uh, and then from that, from that day on, is the day that I learn how to have love with children. Yes, because how to have love with children. Then I said, yes, she's speaking the truth. I was once a child, and when I was a child, I was so much in need of help and mm -hmm. being taken care of. How can I act like this? How can I say I don't like children? How can I be like this? But right now, I have the love of children, mm -hmm. and I love the children around around me. Mm -hmm. And if if you continue watching the Triple L, you will see yeah you will just see, see on her head you will just see on her head that so, all that i speak is true mm -hmm. so i mean the truth sucks everybody who like i said who loves hearing the truth nobody nobody likes hearing the truth because sometimes the truth is um hurtful it, it just feels bad you know like for considering if someone doesn't like you it's better that you hear the person the, the truth than you you know 
trying to say no I, the person likes me the person likes me you know you are trying to flip the truth away trying to slip it away and then in the end you give this person your trust and then you know what happens you get your a very beautiful stab in the back a nice one with a knife mm. and then they, they also drag the knife down the back just to add to the betrayal so it's better you hear the truth because I mean <laughs> It hurts more to be lied to than, than the truth. It's better to hear the truth than to be lied to because finding out you are lied to is way worse. It feels way worse. Do you like being lied to? No. I'm very sure you don't like being lied to. Of course not. You don't like it, you see? So we should learn how to accept the truth. You know, when someone is telling us the truth about something, it may sound ugly, but we have to accept it mm. if it is the truth. Exactly. Especially, uh, especially with the people around us, they know us better. Maybe mm -hmm. your thought about the truth, about the situation, then what attitude you have, you just learn something new, and it's something new that you learn about. It's just not good. Mm -hmm. Maybe it was just a calm person. You're not in bad groups, and then now you start to hunt those bad groups because of your financial life, and then when your financial life is not going well, and then you are trying to find those people that are experiencing stealing and then people around you that we don't know you as you're like that you are becoming a bad person right now mm. why are you acting like that and when people are telling you don't tell me like that i have been like this i have been like this no we don't know you as you are such a kind of a person like that you know mm -hmm. so for me I had um, a very uh, many past encounters with, I like speaking the truth, I also find it very hard to lie, I don't really like lying, it's not my thing. So sometimes I speak, I'm, I'm gonna say, I'm not gonna say no, people are, are being mean to me, but sometimes I speak a truth too much and it hurts other people, which is wrong, um, sometimes I should just keep quiet, it's not good to be truthful all the time because some truth hurts people, even though it's true, it hurts people, so I just keep quiet, because I mean, I don't want to get a big giant punch in the nose no i don't want that so i'm just gonna be like i'm gonna keep quiet no it's okay it's okay she's and you know when you speak the truth sometimes the person is like what did you say no 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 nothing i i i i, I, I mean it's really such a beautiful day today it's a beautiful day isn't it that's why i do yeah i like speaking the truth and for me many people around me they are always like like whenever i'm at school and then they're like Oh, do you know this? And I'm like, really? Can I hear? And then she's like, brah, aren't you afraid? And I'm like, afraid of what? I want to hear. I want to know the truth. Because the truth sets you free. Live it. You know, when you live it, it will set you free. You know, you don't have any things because you don't want to be lied to because being lied to hurts way worse than the truth does. Trust me when I say it works. It just hurts way worse. So this is why I prefer to hear the truth rather than someone lying to me. I want to hear you telling me the truth. Sometimes the truth costs blood, you know, and sometimes the truth costs hatred. You know, you want to speak out the truth, like that man, I don't know, I forget his name. The man that I wanted to let us know about the fish rod, you know, about the fish rod, this man, he was so much, uh, He's not when he came the... in Namibia, he feels so sorry about the, yeah, the corruption. situation. Namibia yeah. is a very uh, small country, but people are in we are living in poverty yeah. and then he will really feel hurt when he sees that the money is going with the just people rotting like that yeah. you know and, and and then he wanted to speak out the truth and when he came he come to some of the leaders that i cannot speak you know the truth hurt you know mm -hmm. okay and then when he talked to them these leaders he, they said why are you so much worried about the things of yeah, our motherland? Yes, our country. This is our it's country. Ours. Go back where you come from until these leaders, they just make the thing worse. Mm -hmm. And then Zakaria have just to tell Al Jazeera in the whole world, everyone is listening to the point that even us, we are no more scared to speak about it because, you know, uh, it's on Al Jazeera. Practically, every, it's everywhere. It's everywhere. Everyone it's knows. everywhere. You see, um, also, you know? one thing I'd like to say is you should never ever try to hide the truth mm. because, you know, I think, you know, whenever you're in a problem and you are stuck somewhere and you're afraid of the person finding out, you're afraid that when this person finds out, you'll be in trouble. Mm. It is better you speak it out immediately because mm. if you don't, this situation escalates, it becomes way worse, worse. and when it comes out, it's 
like horrible. that fish rod. It know? comes out horrible. The, he was just trying to speak to the leaders and saying they speak, no. But because maybe the leaders, they were also afraid, afraid that because they are involved in that fish rod, they have to send Zacharias back. Mm. But then Zacharias feels so much bad. And he feels so Zacharias? much bad. I don't... Uh, okay, maybe it's not his name. I'm sorry. But this man... Okay, let me say this man. He's, he feels so much bad. He had just to go to the white, yeah, yeah. to to the world uh, in the public, you know, and stuff like the that. The white broadcast. But I'm know? sure that if they, the, our leaders would have just listened to him from the beginning, the beginning, then all these things, things was not or supposed to be known in the whole world. In the whole world, yeah. You know, if he if he wouldn't, because the truth you never try to hide it. Mm. It is always going to be found out. And Somebody this, is yeah. always going to find out. And then this man was. <laughs> also say he confessed and he says i'm scared you know he's scared because he might he think that maybe those people are involved in free fraud they want to kill, kill him, him. Yeah. because some of them um, up to now they are not known that they are involved in this fish rod but we salute you yeah. may the lord bless you which is um, we're really thankful for the fact yes. that he revealed the truth revealed the so truth. that is a very uh good example of what will happen when you try to hide the truth mm -hmm. because no matter how much you try to hide it it's just not gonna work and it's not working with the mm -hmm. person who's proud yeah you know? mm -hmm. if you are proud the truth cannot help you because like those are leaders then he, they, he came you know he came to to them so they can discuss yeah. but they were so much proud they didn't want to listen to the point that, yeah to the point that the thing was just known no. in the whole world you, you see know? and it's way embarrassing now <laughs> it's super embarrassing you see what happens when you try to hide something and when you are proud about the truth and especially when you keep doing it over and over it's going to get found out eventually mm -hmm. i don't know how but for some reason no matter how much you do something bad eventually is going to get found and, and that's why the way of jesus he was he, people hated him because of the truth mm -hmm. but later on uh, these people they were just hating themselves because people were just giving themselves to the lord jesus christ giving themselves to the lord jesus christ and up to now mm -hmm. people uh, they don't want uh, the word of god yeah to be spoken because they know that if the word of god is spoken the light will come and everyone this light will know that who who is hiding there? Who who is eating this? Who who is eating that? And that's why they are trying to live in the dark. So they are not being seen of the bad things that they do. This is the truth. Yes. They don't want the truth at all. No, no, no. The truth is the only answer because um, the reason why I'm saying that is because there was this other documentary I was watching about this man who he, he was obsessed with this girl from um, a restaurant and she was a server there. She was just working as a waiter. And then he just got obsessed with her, he kept stalking her, and then one day, he, he, you know, she was walking from work, he came with his car, he passed by, and then he told her to get in, and he had a gun. So she got in, and then later on, he took her to her house, to his house, and then he killed her there. And you know, people, it, it, was, it became an unsolved mystery. People were always wondering, what happened? You know, they were trying to find who the killer was. And you know what happened after years and years and years of trying to find it? Another detective decided to reopen the case again. When he reopened the case, after years and years, this man was like, he was, I think he was 84 when he was discovered. He was old, like old. Mm. He was mm. really old. Mm. But even if he was old, he probably thought, oh my goodness, I got away with this. <laughs> But then it didn't work out, even though it took years, mm -hmm. the truth was still discovered. Mm -hmm. You see, no matter, it, it, it's just impossible, no matter how hard you try to hide something, you know, you've done to erase the, the what is it? Yes. The proof, you everything, pretend, like, pretend, uh, nothing has happened. hide the proof of everything. It mm -hmm. seems mm -hmm. you just cannot run away from the truth. You can try to run. You see? You can run, but you cannot hide. The truth will always find you. But we must just accept the truth. But mm -hmm. For me, I say, I don't like the truth, but uh, I have just to take it. Yes! Yes. Take it for myself. But yes. It's not mm -hmm. easy. It's, it's not easy. Not easy, but it helps. Mm -hmm. It really helps. So, it's anytime open. you are afraid of something or the truth being revealed, accept it before it escalates. Mm -hmm. You see, learn to hear the truth before it escalates. As we gave you an example of of how um, 
this this uh, the, the fish men. rod, the fish rod, and how it happened. Mm -hmm. they, they thought that it would grow, but it didn't. They thought they, they thought that they solved the problem when they, they solved sent, the problem. They sent him that go back. Why are you worried with the they things didn't. of our motherland? It just yeah. escalated, just <laughs> like when when you when you know the truth. Like when I told you that I give an example as an example, right? When someone doesn't like you and you want to pretend like no 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 this person likes me. You see. The person doesn't like you, you know, mm -hmm. you know, but you're like, no, 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 they like me, yes. no, they like me, you are holding on, you don't want to let go because you are and I until you unfortunately, you, unfortunately, you get disappointed, unfortunately, I don't want to like you, but this is earth, this is the world, this is hell, mm -hmm. the earth, you should consider the world as a hunting ground, this is where if you are weak, then if you are weak, then the prey, I think the lion is going to come and hunt you and you're going to get caught. You see, it's going to take you, devour you and eat you. You are not going to survive if you don't like the truth. Yes, because this is life. You see? So that is all we have for you guys today. That is all we want to tell you. So and don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe. And subscribe. And subscribe. And subscribe. And subscribe. And subscribe. Yes. Bye guys. Thank you for listening.